<coughs> Good day. My name is Chester the Chimpanzee, and my protege, Mr. Travis, who normally hosts Wonder Time, is unfortunately indisposed today, so he's asked me to take over for him. So we've got a wonderful show today. We've got a wonderful program. We're talking all about our shapes. Yes, our shapes. And we've got a, a, a pleasant little song all that teaches us about our shapes. It's, it's almost like a little game. So before we jump into our song today, let's take a look at our shapes. So for this song, we need to learn six shapes, six shapes. The first shape is one you'll undoubtedly know. It's the only shape we'll be looking at today that has no sides because it is round. It is round, it has no sides, and it's called the circle. The circle, yes. The next shape has four sides, four sides of equal length. So let's count them. One, two, three, four. Four sides, and it is called the square. The next one has not four, but three sides, three sides, three pointy sides, and it's called the triangle. Yes, triangle. And then we have another shape that has four sides as well, but two of them are longer than the other two, and that is called the rectangle. Rectangle, yes. Then this shape here has actually six sides and six corners, and it is called the hexagon. Hexagon. Can you say that? It's a big word. Hexagon. Let's count the sides. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yes. And finally, our last shape. It looks like what you might normally call a diamond, but in mathematical terms, mathematical jargon, if you will, <laughs> it is called the rhombus. It's kind of an interesting word. Rhombus. I like saying it. How about you? Everybody, let's, let's say it. Rhombus. Okay. So those are the shapes we need to know today. So this, let's listen to our song. This song is called The Hole in the Bucket. And we're going to have to figure out what shapes will fix the said hole in the bucket. There's a hole in the bucket, dear Liza, dear Liza. There's a hole in the bucket, dear Liza, a hole. Dear Henry, dear Henry, dear Henry, we'll fix it, dear Henry. Just fix it. With what shape shall I fix it, dear Liza, dear Liza? With what shape shall I fix it, dear Liza? What shape? Henry, if you take a look at the hole in your bucket, how many sides does that hole have? Hmm. Oh, I think I know the answer, Liza. All right. Well, what shape are you going to use? Ah. A triangle. A triangle. A triangle, a triangle. Now, Henry, a triangle has how many sides? Let's take a look. It goes one, two, three. And the hole in your bucket has no sides. It's round, completely round. So what shape is completely round? Oh. <laughs> a circle, a circle, a circle, a circle. Good job, Henry. But Liza, I've got another hole in the bucket. There, Liza, there, Liza. Another hole in the bucket. There, Liza, a hole. Well, fix it, dear Henry, dear Henry, 
dear Henry. We'll fix it, dear Henry. Fix the hole. With what shape shall I fix it, dear Liza, dear Liza? With what shape, shape shall I fix it, dear Liza? What shape? Well, Henry, let's take a look at this at this hole. Let's see. We've got sure. We've got a hole with three sides. A hole with three sides, and you just saw. You just saw. It worked with a hole with three sides. What shape do you think that would be? Three sides. <laughs> okay. A uh, triangle, dear Eliza. Dear Liza, a triangle. Correct, Henry. Good, Henry. All right, now you can go get some water. But Liza, I've got another hole in my bucket. Dear Liza, dear Liza, another hole in my bucket. Another hole, Liza. We'll fix it, dear Henry, dear Henry, dear Henry. We'll fix it, dear Henry. Fix the hole. With what shape shall I fix it, dear Liza, dear Liza? With what shape shall I fix it? With what shape shall I use? Well, Henry, let's take a look. This hole has four sides. Let's count them. One, two, three, four. And two of them are longer than the other two. So what shape do you think you would use? <laughs> I got it now. I got it now, Liza. It's a square, dear Liza. Dear Liza, a square, because a square has four sides. Yes, yes, Henry, but also a square has four equal sides. You've got a, you've got a shape there that has two longer sides and two shorter sides. So what shape are you going to use? <laughs> You're right. I was mistaken. I'll use a rectangle, a rectangle, a rectangle, a rectangle. Very good, Henry. But, um, <clears throat> Liza, I've got one. I was looking all around, and I've got one more hole in the bucket. Now there's that hole in a bucket, dear Liza, dear Liza. I'm under the hole in the bucket. The, this is the last hole. Well, fix it, dear Henry, dear Henry, dear Henry. Well, fix it, dear Henry. Just fix the hole. With what shape shall I fix it, dear Liza, dear Liza? With what shape shall I fix it? Dear Liza, what shape? Henry, I think you can figure this out yourself. All right. Well, let's see. If I count the sides, let's see. I got one, two, three, four sides. Four sides. So that could be a rectangle. But a rectangle, let's see, has two long sides and two short sides. And this one looks like it has four sides that are equal length. <gasps> I know what that is. I looked at it before. A square, dear Liza, dear Liza, dear Liza. A square, dear Liza, I'll fix it with a square. You fixed it, dear Henry, dear Henry, dear Henry. You fixed it, dear Henry. Now go get some water. <laughs> Thank you. 
for joining us today on Wonder Time. We will see you again in another few weeks. Again, I am Chester the Chimpanzee, and for my co-host, Mr. Travis, thank you, thank you, thank you. Goodbye.